<laughs> Hi, and welcome to Rad Linux, and today I'm talking about the new bow drivers. Because, you know, I'm not like a giant fan of the new bow drivers. I don't use them uh, very often anymore, uh, as I've figured out better ways to run them. Older GPUs, I think. I like the proprietary drivers. But I was kind of, I guess not, uh, I was kind of annoyed, I guess, to be honest, to realize that for the period of time I was running the Nouveau drivers, I was probably not getting video acceleration. And you might say, like, well, why is that? You know, I mean, we all know that Nouveau supports video acceleration. Uh, that's one of its features. They support, you know, 3D acceleration, video acceleration, uh, 2D acceleration. Well, why wouldn't I be getting acceleration on my card? Uh, and it turns out that, you know, basically Nouveau can't ship parts of the NVIDIA drivers. So Nouveau can't ship the firmware to allow you to access your card's internal codex, right? Uh, I think this is primarily an issue for older cards. I'm not sure that it's necessarily an issue for modern GPUs. It might be though, to be frank. Uh, so there's a quick way to check and see if you are running the appropriate uh, firmware for your system. Uh, and that is a simple program called VA Info. It, very is likely very likely is like already installed and if it's not already installed on your distribution you can check it out in uh their you know your distribution's repository download va info and run it if it returns a list of codecs you're good that means that you have the proper firmware for your card uh and you're you're good to go now if you're if it returns a bunch of errors then you don't have the proper firmware for your card now, it might be tempting to look through your repositories and find Nouveau firmware and think that you're going to find the solution. But again, Nouveau cannot ship these firmwares. That's a whole other set of stuff. So what you really want to do is we're today we're, we're, we're going to want to uh, get the firmware directly from NVIDIA. And I'm going to walk you through that process because, of course, Nouveau has some documentation about this, but it's old. Uh, and you can see here, right, it ends at, on uh, 900 series GPUs. Maybe beyond that, this isn't an issue because uh, 1050 and up are currently supported by NVIDIA. So I'm honestly not sure how that works. I haven't used Nouveau on a card or on a 10 and up series card. So that's not an issue for me. I said 1050, 10, 10 series, 10 series and up. Uh, so I, I don't really know, uh, but I do know this documentation looks kind of old and it feels kind of old to me. Uh, there is no video acceleration uh, pretty much beyond the 8 series uh, that, that's going to do much for you or it's going to be much help aside from like maybe if this ever got completed. Because again, I think these two do's are probably like... Uh, at least six years old at this point. This documentation looks really old. Uh, but it does work. So let's go through it. So let's say you ran VA info and you had a problem, right? And your card should have acceleration. You're not getting acceleration. So uh, I'm going to just kind of give you a little bit of a walkthrough and, and, and we'll clean things up along the way. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to make a new directory in your temp folder. Uh, and you want to call it Nouveau. We're going to do it in the temp folder because it's going to be a cleaner experience. And when we, re we reboot, it's going to get rid of all this mess we make. So it's always nice to do these kinds of things in temp. So you're not just building a bunch of unnecessary files in your home folder or something. Uh, we're going to want to go to that folder. So we're going to CD to it. Pretty straightforward. And then we're going to use wget. Wget's basically like download uh, you download, it'll download from what you direct it to. Uh, and so if you W get this, this is a, a tool, uh, a Python tool, Python script. Uh, it's going to help us in a moment. Uh, and then the next thing is we're going to actually download the drivers directly from NVIDIA. You can see here that they're actually pointing us at 325 drivers. 
Uh, and I don't even know, that's not even like legacy version, I don't think. That's probably just the latest version that was available at that time. Uh, and I wouldn't necessarily expect this to have a benefit. I would suspect it would be better to download the latest driver that works for your system. So for me, I have like cards that work for the 340 driver. The latest 340 driver in Legacy uh, is 340.108. So I could replace this 325 and this 325 with 340.108. And that will download the latest 340.108 drivers. Now, if this actually, I don't have 390 cards to test this against. If this actually is a problem for like 390 era cards as well, I mean, maybe it might even be an. A modern error, a modern problem, I don't actually know. Uh, again, I've never run the 10 series or, or higher on Nouveau. Uh, so, but if, if you do need to do that, you could probably put like 390 and whatever the last 390 driver was there and download that directly. So whatever you do, you, you can download that. Uh, and we're going to download it right to this folder. And then we're going to basically extract the driver. So we're going to extract it, but we're not going to install it. Uh, that's what this command does. Uh, it, it runs this and it extracts it. Now, I think, I don't think you have to ch mod that. I feel like I had to ch mod plus x that. I don't know. Either way, it doesn't matter. Uh, you, you either need to ch mod plus x it or not. If it doesn't work, try that. Uh, but if we go over here, we're going to go to this next one. This is another dated thing. It says uh, we're going to run the Python script, right? So we're going to run that Python script we did earlier. Uh, but the script is, says over here is for Python version 2 only. But that's not really true. If you go to the GitHub, you can see that it has been updated for Python 3, which leads me to believe, again, that this is just really dated documentation. Uh, so... That's not great, but it's what it is. Uh, run it. You might run into some errors, but that doesn't necessarily mean that nothing happened. Uh, I keep getting errors on when it's like trying to find like the Titan firmware or something like that. Uh, and a couple other like for specific firmware, like three firmware that don't pull properly. But uh, if you run it against 340 drivers, you know, You'll get the errors, but you'll still populate the folder with all the firmware finds. So uh, from there, we're going to make a new directory in our lib firmware uh, nouveau. I think mine is actually, is it lib firmware nouveau? Okay, yeah. Uh, well, so we're going to make a new folder there. We're going to name it nouveau. Uh, and we're going to copy all the stuff that's in our directory right now. Uh, over to that new thing. We're going to have to do both of these last two commands as root. So either using sudo or dropping into su, whatever your comfort level is, whatever you prefer to do. Uh, and from there, uh, we just need to reboot and try running VA info again. And fingers crossed, you just might get video acceleration. Uh, if you're running into a problem, uh, let me know in the comments. Maybe I'll be able to help. But uh, aside from that, pretty much all I got for you here. Uh, I just I just thought this was like pretty uh, old and confused me a little bit at first. So I just wanted to run through that. And I don't think that most people know if they're running Nouveau that they're they're not getting what they should be getting out of it. Now there's some other stuff down here about, uh, I don't know how to use it. Uh, a couple, a couple missing issues. They keep saying that you need to use like a Mesa version compiled with VDPAU state tracker enabled. Uh, but I, I don't I don't even know uh, if you need to do that anymore, if that just kind of has that built in for the most part at this point. Uh, but you might need to patch your Mesa if that's what it takes, uh, if, if it's still not really working properly. Also, again, you're probably not going to see huge boosts in performance here. But uh, yeah, okay, cool. That's a, That's all I got for you today. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, also, thanks for watching that last video. There's a lot of people who keep watching my stupid Flipper Zero video. And uh, okay, cool. Thank you. <laughs>